I see you, champion. Sit, please. You shouldn't miss this chance to trade. You should know the rebels have been busy. They've set up outposts to the west. And I know the marshals can't deal with all of them, so I'd stay alert out there if I were you. Thanks for the warning. Keep your eyes open. This might out. stop the rebels from killing more of their own. Maybe Marshal's ahead. I need? I should check all the machine carcasses here.
find what I needed. I'll have to go to the machine site. I'd find them here. Getting rid of their leader might cause the rest to leave. <laughs> Facet ammo could help here.
Yeah! 
Duco will want to see these. Without a leader, the rebels should abandon this place. But I could always deal with them. No. Either way, I'm done here. I'll grab this now. Causing any more trouble? Keep some extra on hand. Save this for a dire.
Shark ammo could help. I better loot all the carcasses here. Might have the parts I need. For the next fight. Frost ammo could help here.
Better loot all the machine carcasses here. I might find the parts I need. Find another herd and get the parts I need. Slow going if I use acid on it.
Time to fight. <laughs> I should loot all these dead machines. See if they have the parts I need. Water ammo should do the trick.
but also on Camp Talon, what we're trying to find should be around here. Smart. Could be from the camp. Maybe I should check it out. Maybe it might be the Osram camp that you all told me about. I should talk to their leader. Now she's in the wilds, all alone. Forge knows all the things that could kill her out there. Someone ran off? I forgot her name. Kept quiet. Couldn't tell if she was shy or scared. All I know is she didn't want anyone near her things. That's for sure. I was just curious is all. She didn't have to slug me. Your glass jaw ain't the problem, Lugnut. The girl is. All alone in the bush? And this is Tanakh territory. Which way did she go? West, up the slope. Look for her if you can. I will. Careful now. The girl's maladjusted. do not guarantee success. Brewing ale does. Looks like what? we have company. Why not rest for a moment, Brad? I must be closing in on the signal. I suppose I should thank you for getting us back to work. Talana, glad to see you made it. Thanks to the secret passage through your base. It was quite a sight. Secret passage? Don't let the others hear you say that or you'll have a lot of Osiram knocking at your door. And you are? This is Ragard. He's a scout with this caravan. He says Amadis was here. He joined up with our expedition right before we went through the tunnel. After we made camp here, I set out to do some scouting. I also made peace offerings to the Tanakh for trespassing in their territory. Amadis wanted me to ask around about some place called... The Rot. What did you find out? Most I learned was that it's where the Tanakh took their prisoners. Somewhere far to the west near Thornmarsh, the Lowland Clan's capital. He set out to find it not long after. Uh, on his own? I tried to warn him, but... He was dead set on going. Did Amada say anything about why he was heading to the Rot? Afraid not. He was a man of few words. Sounds like him. Did he look okay to you? More or less. He seemed shaken when we learned the tunnel had collapsed behind us. But then again, so was everyone around here. What happened when you went through the tunnel? Nothing. Our crew split into two groups to pass through. Everyone here was part of the first crossing. Aside from some pitch-black passages, it was quiet. Whatever befell the second group spared us. Steel Spark be praised. But you best talk to Porkov about that. He knows a bit more than I do. So you're a scout for this crew. Anything I should know about the area? Where to start? 
Down south, we've got a trio of Osirum trying to delve into the ruins of the sand. There are more of you? They're the ones we followed out here in the first place. And then there are all the other folk who broke away as soon as we got to this side of the tunnel. Salvagers, explorers, all sorts of daring venturers. Just how many of you were there? Enough to lose track, that's for sure. I've also spotted some rebels a while back, too. Seems like they've been patrolling the desert. Heard all about the rebellion from the Tanakh up in Scalding Spear. That's the Desert Clan's capital, north of here. Sounds like you've really gotten to know the area. It's what I do. Thanks, Ragert. This has been helpful. Hope you find him. Okay, I'll have the Thormarsh. Meet me there. Hold on. What? You're willing to go to the ends of Tanakh territory to find this guy. No hesitation. Of course, he's one man alone in the Forbidden West. I'm just worried about him. I think it's more than that. I'll meet you near the Lowland capital. But then, you're going to tell me who Amadis really is. Fine. I'll lay low, north of the village. See you there. Ignoring me again? If you're feeling bold, there's a Tanakh outpost nearby. The rebel kind. Got something you'll want to hear, Red. You might want to avoid going too deep into the desert, especially the southwest. One of our scouts ran into some nasty Tanakh down there, the kind that contain machines. He barely made it back alive. Thanks for letting me know. The rebels are as friendly as ever. I wonder what they're doing this far out in the desert. Everywhere you look, have some more blasting now. Are you lost? Spark to steal. Aren't you a jewel in a junk heap? Excuse me? Hold the hammer? I know you. You're that Nora. <laughs> the savior. My savior. Right in the nick of time. The name's Poor Guff Delvesman, chief delver and leader of Poor Guff's expeditioners and purveyors of fine delvewares. What am I saving you from, exactly? Death and despair, my steel flame friend. See, this grand expedition here has had a, a minor setback. Not far from here, there's a secret tunnel, a passage of the old ones, lost and then found. Me and half the crew came through first. The other half was supposed to follow right after. But days later, only one man turned up shivering like a frog in chill water. Only thing we got out of him was that death and darkness chased them as the tunnel collapsed. Died with his eyes wide, he did. I've been to the tunnel's eastern side. The way was blocked by rubble. There was also a body, one of your delvers, I guess, but no sign of the rest of the crew. Keep your voice down, will you? The rest of the crew's already spooked. They're refusing to press on with the delve until they're assured a way out of here. You lost half your crew, and you're worried about the Delph. We gotta make their sacrifice worth something, right? And besides, now that you're here, maybe our sand-stranded days are over. Help me get that tunnel reopened, and I'll cut you in on the Delver's fee. What do you say? What do you know about this area? Well, north of here you got those vicious Tanakh. I heard rumor they drink blood instead of water. That's how they survive this wasteland. And south, it has it all. Death, desert, and the delve. Imagine, if you will, a vast grave of the old ones. Ruins of twisted metal concealed by the sands. All guarded by machines. So fierce that you'll wish you had a flock of glint hawks swooping down on you instead. Not even the Tanakh venture into the ruins' depths. Only the bravest explorers dare enter. Like yourself? Of course. Eventually.
So this camp, it's your base of operations? What operations? The plan was to move further south once the rest of the expedition joined us. The delve is right out beyond those dunes. But now the crew refuses to budge until this tunnel mess gets sorted out. They've even given this place a name. Camp Nowhere. I think they're mocking me. Yeah, I think they are. How did you learn about this secret tunnel? The art of the Delve, of course. A Delve is only as good as his no sense for good sights. All right, fine. I heard about three Osram who knew a way to bypass those bloodthirsty Tanakh. Tap the untouched Delves of the West. So then I may have employed someone with the know-how for finding and following. A spy. Look, if the rumors are true, there's enough delving to employ a dozen operations. But someone has to take the first plunge, establish a base camp, set up a reliable supply route, guard the site against machines. Figures the Osram would turn sand into shards, I guess. Exactly. I'll see what I can do about the tunnel. Ha <laughs> ha! My savior. For the crew trapped here with you, not your delve. One and the same. That it? Over there? That it is. Oh, and while you're at it, would you mind keeping an eye out for my lockbox? The second crew was supposed to bring the rest of the supplies and belongings. I'd hate to lose it to the wilds. It was hand carved by my dear old ma. I'll bring it back if I find it. I'd appreciate it. Good luck, Still Flame. Dudes might look peaceful, but they hide all kinds of things. Looking sharp as ever. This was a weapon I had. the entrance to the tunnel further. I need to find his missing expedition. A clear path back east. Tunnel's blocked. And no sign of the missing expedition. I need to find a way to get further in. Should be able to blow up that fire beam. Fire them out of here. <laughs> There's someone still alive in here. to you. A terror in the dark. The world shuddered. A machine? Never got a look. The caravan. <clears throat> we all ran. Everything collapsed. We crawled here. Couldn't escape. Did anyone make it out? And find the first caravan. Yes. Someone did. Good. At least... I'm not alone. Rest easy now. Sounds like something big attacked the missing expedition. I better press on.
missing expedition. Calling back up. Room. She said they were attacked by some kind of terror. I don't think it was these borrowers. See anything? Should be able to clear that rubble with my full castle. here quick. It looks like it lets out ahead. A rock breaker. It must
must have attacked the Osirim as they were passing through.
The author must have entered the canyon on the eastern side. I better take a look. These carts must be the supplies the second crew was supposed to bring over. Porgif said his lockbox was supposed to be among them. Porgif's lockbox. I should take it back to him. like it came down when the rock breaker attacked. I must have trapped the Osram in the canyon. The rest must have run into the western tunnel. I'm gonna get to the other side. I should be able to blow this up to clear the debris. Be clear now. I better let Portis know. Code. Maybe I should look through my data points.
back in no man's land. Now it'll be easier to go back and forth.
Let's see. So, if we add all the days lost to being stuck in Camp Nowhere, and throw in some hazard pay, because no doubt the crew will demand it, but reduce the number of the crew by half. Oh, and can't forget the Savior's Delvin fee. I hear the Tanakhs are fighting each other quite a bit these days. Once the Delves up and running, Some of them can the change machines. Those you've got to be real careful of. We've seen a whole bunch of them setting up outposts around here. Spotted one just west of here. A few settled at the edge of the desert in the southwest. They even set up camp in the south. Really helps a fellow sleep at night. Just make sure you steer clear of them. Be Those rifles are bad business. I'll keep an eye out for them while I'm out here. You're back! How's that tunnel looking? I found the rest of your crew. One of them was still alive. For a while, anyway. Turns out a rock breaker attacked them as they were making their way through. Poor Saz. Many roads lead to Adelva's end, but that's got to be one of the worst. Well, I took care of the rock breaker. The way's clear now. Ha <laughs> ha! I knew you could do it! And, uh, you didn't happen to find my lockbox now, did you? Here you go. Spark in the dark! Is there nothing you can't do? Here, your fee as promised. Now that the threat's gone, I'll have the tunnel shored up and cleared out. Then I can send for another crew, get this expedition going proper like. Ha! Onwards to the delve! The sky's getting dark. Mine's settling in. hearing about people riding machines around here. Not sure what they want or where they came from. 